Hello and welcome. We are back at it again. We are in Valheim. How are you, Debster? Hi. Yeah, good. Thank you. You all right? Very good indeed. And we still have all this smelting. And the idea is for it to carry on smelting. Because today is the day that we get some good armor, maybe some fine wood. We get the ability to chop some of these white trees and we will be able to craft some of these other stuff and the bench upgrades that we've unlocked recently. So, yeah. I need the axe. It's looking good. We've got a forge already, but we don't have this. And we don't have the anvils neither, nor the forge cooler. And I don't have an axe. And she needs an axe. I need an axe. And we can make a cart, which would help us to get wood. Oh, I forgot about the cart. And a big boat. We can make a boat as well. <gasps> oh, yeah, let's make a boat. So, it is looking good. Please can't have It's going to take a little bit more. And with an axe, we can also make with bronze. We could make a rig and start cultivating. Oh yeah, we got seeds. I forgot about the seeds. So, yeah, we're going to let that all finish cooking. And we're going to replenish on wood. And we might carry on flattening around a little. And making it all a lot nicer. We might need to move the base altogether. Because this is Why? a lake. Oh, it is. It's not the sea. Hmm. This is a problem indeed. Okay, base number two coming up. Yeah, so we'll have to do a second base. Um, a fishing place. <laughs> shall we say. But for now, we'll make this nicer. <laughs> there you go. So we've got all this working. Um... Kind of going around like a headless chicken, gonna understand what we need and we don't need. We need an axe. <laughs> we do. I need a brand axe, and look, I can get rid of this tree. And that's it for now. And we'll be back in a bit. See ya. See ya. And we are back. And Bye. Debster's got now a bronze axe. Show it for everybody. Look at that. Hi. That'll help. And I'm gonna take some of this and make myself something. Oh. Bronze. Really heavy. I can do two of them. And my idea is a bronze mate. That's what I really want. I need it. But, mm -hmm. oh, there is a possibility that this one is worse than this one. But it's okay. not. This old club is going to go to old equipment. That was good enough. You've served as well. We'll leave you there. Mm -hmm. And for now, we're going to go explore. Because we figured out... That probably we're not in the best place. Now, that will change. We will make it change for the better. But it is going to take a bit of exploration. Because we don't know the territory around us. And it'd be a good idea that we did. So, we're going to go for a slip. And mm -hmm. we're going to wake up and explore the lands. Valheim. And find a good place. Next to the sea. Next to the sea. Not a lake. <laughs> Originally we wanted for it to be next to the water. But simply water is not going to cut it. So um, we will finish this place up and make it nice. And it'll still be a base. But as you know Valheim you need more than one base to go around. So it's time that we get our second base ready. Yay. Which is going to be an experience and a half. 
<laughs> We're gonna get this fully filled up as well. It's not fully filled up at the moment, but it will be. Need to put that in here now. It's quite heavy, quite annoying. Get all that wood. Are you okay for food? Yep. What do we need for the cartographer table? Berries. We do we need berries for it? Stupid. Berries? Right. We need your bronze axe eventually to cut some fine wood. But for now, we need to make this map more visible. <laughs> so, that fog of war needs to disappear really. Right. There's this guy here. He doesn't know who he's messing with. He's not messing with me really because I can't hit it. Ooh, right. that was class. So, guys, um, we were walking around this coast, trying to unlock more of the map, like we were saying. Which is still an idea that we'll keep in mind, but this looks, for me, like the ocean or the sea. Somewhere mm -hmm. where we can put a boat down and really explore. But also, we figured out there's a maple here. And for those that you don't know, these structures are actually quite hard to find. And you cannot build them yourself. And they give you a plus one on the comfort bonus. So we should build here our base. And for now, what we're going to do is just... Uh, Make this a better place without destroying that maple. Otherwise, everything is gone. But regardless, even without that maple, this would be a good place to build. So, we'll crack on. See you in a bit. Hey, some skeletons here. Oh, hello. Perfect. <laughs> I can't pick him up. I got it, yeah. Right, um... Do you think we need to clear these trees up? Oh, ah, okay. We can't clear this up. I don't think I can pick any of the bones. Like, there is... Yeah, there. I can. Is there anything in this place? This is a tiny block forest biome. It is, we That's could... It. We could dispose of those trees. There's something to loot up here, but I'm sure we'll loot it at some point. But mm. now I think I'm gonna go back to the base and drop some stuff off and maybe make a path to here. We'll see That'd how that good. goes. We'll need to, yeah. Gonna be Is some... it quick, quicker to go across this way? Yeah. Not that far away, are we? Ooh. Well, see you in a bit. See you in a bit. Oh, I'm getting ambushed there. Right. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm gonna die. Are you okay? Maybe. Mm. But I use bow and arrow. Oh. I miss. Maybe if I. One down. Ooh, that was very close. Oh, it's a brute, isn't it? Oh. 
careful. Oh. Ooh. Right, that did it. <sighs> that was an intense moment that we were going through here. Um. Oof. Yeah. Right. Interesting, nonetheless. Uh, I'm here at the new location, and this is gonna be the Flate's headquarters. I'm just making a path back to the base, and. Yeah, I'm having a bit of tr trouble here in this area, but I'm sure we'll manage. I'm You'll sure. be fine. <laughs> but now we're going to break some of these. going to claim back the land. Yep. And uh, we'll get on a bit further. So it's been a while and all of these is almost fully smelted for not to say actually we can put it all in and just wait for it to be done mm -hmm. there you go the last bit of tin coming through which is quite good to hear and here we go quite the nice but wonky road that's going to take us from the first base to the flades headquarters which is just the name of the place that will be in the middle between us and the ocean. Once we can figure it all out. The Elder is the wrong way where that place is. Which that is the second, <coughs> second problem. Right, so we might need another base somewhere else. But a maple is too good to miss. So that mm -hmm. might be something... That we will be working along other things. But this is the road we've made here. And Debster, do you want to come for a walk? And I do. And show all the road business that we got going on. So we want to be able to make a wood cart to be able to go in between them. Uh, mainly for copper and bronze and tin because we're quite close to that biome so we'd come from there melt it all in there and back to the base this way because we are still sticking by the rules of not using portals for minerals which i think is an interesting idea it makes the game a bit harder but also gives it a bit of a challenge and more role playing and opportunities to build different bases which I think is just what we need at this time. So we're going to leave it like that. We, I, I just, this is a, a rough sketch of a road, really, guys. It, we will make it nice, especially when we get to the Stone Age, and we can start building with with stone and paving it with stone. The roads, we will make something nice. I've taken it out of the way because I don't think the cat will go through all this rubbish. That just knocked a whole lot of other trees. For, maybe for a here. Uh, this will be okay for a bit. Hmm. Let's carry on forward. We'll I remember how wide the cat is. Well, there's different sizes. The, hmm. There's a small cat and a big cat, I think. Or am I getting the wrong game confused? Might be doing that. Oh, that's a good point. Right, so... We are to go down here. Whee. And as I say, things will change. It's a bit wonky in some bits and pieces. But mostly doable. See where you're going. Yeah, it's good. I like it. And this is what we will be calling our second home. Right, I th I it almost crashed there. Right, it was... It's dead. Right. Thank God. Sorry, did you want that? Right, so everything's going to be flattened to the level of maple. Because if we flatten any lower, the maple will break. So we've got to be wary of that. Mm. But yeah, this will be another place to call home. 
Oh. And let's flatten it a bit and make it nice. What do we need for it? Let me see. Eh, hey, it's not bad. Mm. A bit of wood. Easy. Bit of wood and yeah, we can do it. Some bronze nails. Ah, oh, yeah. nice. Okay. You want a cat? Yes, please. Right, you can have your own personal cat there. And mine there. Eh. Hey. Use. Not in the right position. Okay, that way. Look at me. Right. Can I get a ride on your cat? Oh, yeah, I can. Pull me. <laughs> no way. I'm pulling <laughs> her on it. Oh, oh. It, it, it don't work indefinitely. Aww. Let's see if this road is rubbish and it takes damage going up because it usually will take damage going up. Very good. So far it's good. Mm -hmm. We're going for a test run. I don't know if it gets like, as it gets heavier, it gets worse. But for now it's... Oh! Took a bit of damage there. Right. I think this is going to need some sorting with that Battery tree. needs to come out, yeah. But for now, I think it is a good bad. start. It is a good start. We could have filled it with stone. That would have been a really good idea. It would have been a good idea. <laughs> but you know what? We don't I'm need it. I'm not bothered. I can see stone here. I can see stone here. No taking damage, have they? They've updated it. It used to take a lot more damage than this. Oh, I mean, this is going to look rough coming down. Oh, yeah. Just a slight bit of damage. Hmm. Quite resilient, to be honest. It's good. Very good. Right. Homie. You did more damage than... Anything. This <laughs> right, so I think that's a success of some kind. Did so, you repair mine? I did, yeah. I did. Thank you. Now, how about going up? Because we've got to be able to go back and forth. It definitely struggles going up, but it's doable. Mm. So guys, we'll be making this path a bit better. And yeah, we'll see you in a bit. Bye. 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 Well, got plenty of stone here and I'm trying to make a nice path. And well, it is taking a while, but it is getting nicer but it's gonna take a lot of mining so oof, this might take a while <laughs> what i'm doing is pretty much carrying on with the terrain at the minimum depth that i'm allowed to mine right here this is the minimum and it looks pretty rough 
But by being at the minimum, I can always save a few of the rocks off the top like this. Make it nicer. Kind of flat. And once I've got a bunch of the area that I want down, it will flatten back up to whatever level. Kind of flat. And it does make it look nicer. It is taking a while though. You gotta do it gradually. You can't just do it at different levels. Little by little, it is looking nicer. But like now, add what I'm gonna do is, well, steps to be able to get up. <laughs> now, no worries. and then whack it another level, and I whack it again, and I whack it again, and slowly, it creates a slope every two bashes. So what now I can do is, in this level, flatten that, and a bit lower, flatten that, and a bit lower, just mix it in, and it makes kind of a neat slope. And if I repeat this process several times more, it would look better. But my pickaxe is broken. But this is kind of what we're doing. So we'll be back in a bit. Bye. Bye. And we are back, and it has been longer than I was expecting. Probably the time that it took us to build all this, times three times. But mm. we, so far, have made a big progress, is all this. Wow. And the stone keeps on piling up. And the wood, all this. Right. Can I even carry this? To flatten all this and make a ramp, I'm not joking, but you can see how high the walls are. And it's still not even done. I'm not going to be able to pull it all the way up. <laughs> not push. Like, uh... Quite steep. Yeah. But we're going to try and... A bit of a flatter area here. So once we do a bit more progress, oh, I'm back again. <laughs> Did a bit. Hello again, and we're here again. It's been quite a few days since we last saw each other. It's been at least four or five in-game days. Come here, step step. Let's show you what we've done. At first, put your torch on if you can, Debster. Can you pull me up for help? Yeah. So, we've done all this. Let me... This will help. Done all this. And it looks amazing. I've never done a road so big and so much effort behind it. Literally being at it probably the last three hours. Mm. Feel bad I should go. Sorry. It looks awesome, doesn't it? Get on, get on, don't worry. You don't way. wait. <laughs> I don't wait any of it. So we've done all of this, it's taken and we've managed to use absolutely every single stone we had. To flatten all of it. Uh, so, yep, I thought I had loads. We had over six, eight hundred stones. We've used it all. It's still a bit rough in some areas, but seriously, I've had enough of roads for today. It goes all the way through here. Into this area. Which is taking all of the stone because this was all the way down there with the river. 
but now it's a proper path you can just get it all the way here which will be the next kind of phase so i hope you guys enjoyed and i know we have enjoyed and we will be seeing you soon yeah see you soon take care bye, bye.